Hello and welcome to part three of Grim Plays, the Curse of Monkey Islands. So, we chased away the Cabana Boy last episode, so let's see what we got. Well, I can't have dry towels. We need them nice and cold and wet. The towels are all. Okay, let's go. Ouch! Hot! Hot sand! With these holes in my shoes, I'll never get across that hot beach. Why we needed them wet and cold. Mm. All right. I think it's about time we went and paid back that little git with his bottomless mug policy. my time. No, oh, I'm sorry. I'll buy another drink off you. Give me some more lemonade, you little chiseler. That'll be a nickel. <laughs> ah, that was as refreshing as morning dew. How did you drink all the lemonade? You switched mugs on me, you cheat. I hope you're happy. You put a budding young entrepreneur out of business. <laughs> all right. Use the pitch with the red dye. It's full of dye now. Now we head off this way. We want to go back to that beach. Convince the guy he's got a sunburn. I've brought you a new mug. Thanks. Top up your drink, sir. Here's your drink, sir. Look, Palido, you're burning. Ah, all those months in the sun and my tan is just gonna peel away. I better turn over. Months. And there be a map. Oh, this is, um, this is just nasty. So when did come our ship? Well, that... I've got a oh. crew, a map, a ship, and finally got Elaine back. So let's say we head on to Blood Island to lift the curse and save Elaine. How about it, guys? Let's get moving towards Blood Island. Let's head on out and find our fortune, guys. This might be more difficult than I first imagined. Did, did, 
Ah, the sea. I, the sea. Makes you glad to be alive. I think that ship is following us. Feel that salty spray. The sunlight sparkling off the bay. What a glorious seafaring day. It's a pirate ship. We got the outrunner. All right, men, are you with me? Hey, look, guys, a whale. Where? Where? That ship is gaining on us. Cutthroat Bill, rig the top sail. Is that a right whale? No, no, lad. They're boarding us. Crew, help me out here. It is a member of the Cetus suborder, Mr. Shetty, though. I think you're right. Well, well. Rottingham, so it's you. What do you want? Other than a good toupee. I've come for your map to the fabled blood alarm. Then I'll find the diamond you mentioned. It will make a fun paperweight for my escritoire. Ooh, look! It's breaching! Ooh! Ah! Look, Baldy, I'll never give you that map. I need it to save Elaine. Then I'll have to take it from you by foul. That whale must be 30.5 meters. Guys, no help. 100 feet and weigh 200 metric tons. You know, of course, in a sword fight, a sharp weave is much more important than a sharp blade. Of course. Everybody knows that, Chrome Dome. Let's get this over with. Every enemy I've met, I've annihilated. Oh, yeah? Well, you fight like a cow. No, 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 no. That's not right at all. What? On the sea, we fight it a little differently. On the sea, all your insults and threats have to rhyme. What? So when I say every enemy I've met, I've annihilated, you say... I once found some gold, but it was just electroplated? No. You say, with your breath, I'm sure they are suffocated. <laughs> Try that again, shall we? You're as repulsive as a monkey in a negligee. Uh... I'm waiting. I... Uh, I... Just as I thought. You're an amateur with this world. Give me that map. Here, take it. Well, I did beat the Swordmaster of Malay Islands. That's your map? Yes. As soon as I'm through pirating these waters, it's off to blood alone. Until we meet again, Monsieur Tweebud. I've got to get that map back or we'll never find Blood Island. Thanks, guys. You were a world of help back there. It was a rousing battle, Captain. Aye. And it reminds me of a song. Um, when a music in sleep? When you hear a gentle singing, you'll be sure to turn and flee. Oh, this is just ridiculous. Yeah, forget this. No time for song. We got to move. The battle will be long, but our courage we will prove. We're a pack of scurvy sea dogs. Have we pity not a dram? We are a roasted garlic. Dancing from the diaphragm. A pirate I was meant to be. Trim the sails and roam the sea. Okay, yeah, let's go. Come on, men. We've got to recover that map. That pirate will be done for when he falls into our trap. We're a club of tune for rovers. We can sing in every clap. We can even hit the high notes. It's just too bad we're tuned down. A pirate. But I, I was meant to, to be. be. Trim the, the sails, sails and run the sea. sea. I like this. Let's go defeat that evil pirate. We know he's sure to lose because we know just where to fire it. Doesn't even make sense. We're thieving balladeers. A gang of cutthroat mugs. To fight us off, you won't need guns. Just jolly good ear plugs. I was I was meant to be. Trim the sails and roam the sea. Stop, stop, stop. The brass is what we'll polish and the deck is what we'll mop. You say you're nasty pirate scheming thieving babush whackers. From what I've seen, I tell you, you're not pirates, you're just slackers. Pirate I was meant to be. Trim the sails and roam the sea. All right, crew, let's get to work. Our vocation's a thing we love, a thing we'd never shirk. We'll fight you in the harbor. We'll battle you on land. When you meet singing pirates, there'll be more than you can stand. Oh, a pie. That was a no. good one. No, it wasn't. 
I'm running out. Less singing, more sailing. When we defeat our wicked foe, his ship he will be bailing. If you try to fight us, you will get a nasty whacking. If you disrespect our singing, we will beat you to a crack in a pipe. I was, I, I was meant, meant to be the sails and roam the sea. sea. Oh, last one. I'm getting so sick of you guys and your rhyming. I'm not. We're ready to set sail, though the cannons need a priming. We're troublesome corsairs, and we've come to steal your treasures. We would shoot you on the downbeat, but we gotta rest by measures. I have a time was meant to be. Trim the sails and row the sea. Ah, uh, sorry guys. I got no choice. We'll surely avoid scurvy if we all eat an orange. And, um... Well, uh... Door hinge? No, no. Guess the song's over then. Guess so. Okay, back to work. Well, gee, I feel a little guilty now. Good. Captain. Yes, Mr. McMunion. We were wondering, we were, just what kind of captain you are. What do you mean, Haggis? Well, some captains are men of action. They like to have complete responsibility and control for a ship. Other captains prefer to concentrate more on the thinking aspects of captaining. The captain who's a man of action will undoubtedly have a much more difficult time of defeating other scoundrels of the sea in the fast-paced realm of ship-to-ship -ship combat. The more academic captain will find the other pirate vessels he meets to be less aggressive and therefore far easier and quicker to defeat in combat. I see. So, Captain Threepwood, which type of captain be ye? Oh, I'll be, uh... I love I'll go for the tough sea vessels. Sea battle as much as the next captain. Challenging ship combat it is. Whee! Yeah, yeah, go on. You'd better leave now if you value your life. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, a mighty pirate. Don't make me laugh. You're as repulsive as a monkey in a negligee. I look that much like your fiance. <laughs> Every enemy I've met, I've annihilated. With your breath, With I'm, your sure, breath, they I'm sure they all suffocated. suffocated. You're ugly. What an amateur insult. Well, I haven't learned any of this. Devastated, mutilated, and perforated. My entire wardrobe is color coordinated. <laughs> Give me your treasure, you sea skunk. I haven't got any treasure. Why do you think I was attacking you? I guess I need more practice with this sword fighting stuff. Hey, at least yep. I showed him in the high seas combat part. Yep, right. What be ye wanting? Uh, I've come, come to, to plunder your treasure. treasure. You won't live to regret this. I'll leave you devastated, mutilated, and perforated. Oh, yeah? Oh, come on! You're as repulsive as a monkey in a negligee. I am rubber, you are glue. Um... You knew that one a minute ago. Every enemy I've met, I've annihilated. With your breath, I'm sure they all suffocate. Thank you. Would you like to be buried or cremated? These sword fights need to be officiated. Um, oh. I'll skewer you like a sow at a buffet. Woohoo, do I enjoy macrame. And over, yep. Ah, I've beaten you. I will let you live if you give me your treasure. I haven't, I haven't got, got any. Why do you think I was attacking you? I'm attacking you because I need to learn these insults. Get off me, death, you sea slug. I'm Guybrush Guy Street, Street, a mighty pirate. Don't make me laugh. Ha ha ha. Okay. Let's go for the first one. I'll skewer you like a sow at a buffet. Oh, yeah? 
Ah. Would you like to be buried or cremated? I'm shaking. Oh, come on. You use these insults. I'll leave you devastated, mutilated, and perforated. Oh, yeah? Oh, for God's sake. You win! Give me your treasure, you grubby bilge swigger. I didn't want it anyway. It's got that horrible curse. What? Only kidding. We're loaded with booty. Okay. Now. Well, well, well. I guess you've learned an important lesson about cheating. I sure have, mister. Golly, I'll never cheat on anyone ever again. Honest, I've got a new business now, and gosh, it's swell. What is it? I'm running guns. Tell me you're lying. <laughs> I never lie anymore, I'm mister. running guns. You've shown me the light. Can I interest you in some shrapnelizing ammunition designed to bring exquisite pain and unreasonable suffering to all your enemies? What do you have for sale today? Today, customer name here. Uh, what's your name again? Guybrush Threepwood. Today, Mr. Cheap Hood, I can offer you the complete line from Bob's Big Board Boomer Brand Cannon Incorporated. To start with, we have the entry-level model, the Buccaneers Buddy. We also have the following cannon models available. The Ouch Master, the Homemaker Deluxe, the Pain Giver 2000, Mr. Massacre. And finally, the cannon used by that most fearsome scoundrel, Rene Rottingham himself, the Destructomatic T47. So, oh, well, that is one in the way. Like, the front of you. Mister? I'll take the ouch, Master. Now, will that be doubloons, jewels, captured maidens? My ship's hull is full of booty. Well, the amount in your treasure hold is not enough for this model. Not even if I take your old cannon and give you credit for the trade-in. Can I interest you in a less expensive model? Okay, I'll take the Buccaneer's Buddy. The Buccaneer's Buddy. The Buccaneer's Buddy it is. Let me just check my stock. Yep, we got him. You will not be disappointed, my friend. I'll have my mom install your new cannon Prano. While she's at it, I'll also have her pick up the appropriate amount from your hold and pick up your trade-in. Mom! Well, they've been upgraded then. Alright, let's go find someone to buy. I've seen these guys a few times, but hopefully I'm they'll know the answers. A mighty pirate. Don't make me laugh. So I know these first two. So that's suffocated, Beyonce. I'll skewer you like a sow at a buffet. Oh yeah. Guys, seriously, how am I supposed to learn these things if you don't know Would them you like yourselves? To be buried or cremated? With you around, I'd prefer to be humigated. Thank you. I have never seen such clumsy swordplay. Of all crafts, my favorite is paper mache. That's another new one, then. That is so cliche. If this takes too long, do I get overtime pay? Give me your treasure, you sea skunk. Well, if I had me, you'd be the first one to get it. Arr. Okay, so we're going for blue. If you're looking for a fight, you found one. I'm Guybrush Streepwood, a mighty pirate. Don't make me laugh. Alright, that one on. I'll right. skewer you like a sow at a buffet. When I'm done with you, you'll be a boneless fillet. Thank you! I have never seen such clumsy swordplay. Plan for your future with an IRA. 
think you used that one last time. And that one. If this takes too long, do I get overtime pay? Well, at least I learned Open the new one. Hole, you so I may take your treasure. If I had treasure, don't you think I'd spend it before grappling with the likes of you? Hey, I suppose you would. Never mind. I wonder if there's anyone on top of him. There's Semi. There's rotting him. Oh. Come away from the edge. A mighty pirate. Don't make me laugh. That's bonus fillet. So Would you like to be buried or creaming? I'm shaking. I'm oh, shaking. Me. I'll leave you devastated, mutilated, and perforated. Your odor alone makes me aggravated, agitated, and infuriated. Thank you! Throughout the Caribbean, my great deeds are celebrated! I will not rest until all people have been liberated. Yeah, that doesn't I'll mean... skewer you like a saw <gasps> at a buffet! I know this one! When I'm done with you, you'll be a boneless fillet. Okay, uh see I have if you'll never teach us this seen one. such clumsy swordplay. I am rubber, you are glue. Nope, which means I just got his money. Give me your treasure. You filthy unwashed thing, you. Take it. It was cluttering up the hold anyway. We're loaded with booty. Come on in, Kenny. Back again, mister? What do you have for sale today? Today, customer name here. Uh, what's your name again? Guybrush Threepwood. Today, Mr. Leapgood, I can offer you the complete line from Bob's Big Board Boomer Brand Cannon Incorporated. The Ouch Master. The Homemaker Deluxe. Yes, the yes. Giver to... huh. I'll take the Ouch Master. The Ouch Master it is. Mom! So now we got a little extra bit on there. That's the semi fearsome. There's the mildly fearsome.
Yes. You'd best sail away before you get hurt. I've come to plunder your treasure. Good luck, boy. All right, so we know that one, that one, that one. Would you like to be buried or cremated? I am rubber, you are us. Oh, sake. Um, know that one. I have never seen such clumsy swordplay. I'm shaking, I'm shaking. Oh. Honga, touche. I am rubber, you are glue. Seriously? You win. Give me your treasure, yeah, grubby bilge swigger. I didn't want it anyway. We're loaded with booty. All right, let's go upgrade again. Back again. What do you have for sale today? Today? I'll take the Holemaker Deluxe. One Holemaker Deluxe coming right up. Mom! Yeah, that's a Kenny, all right. You'd better leave now if you value your life. Your treasure or your life. You right, won't come get on. to regret this. Would you like to be buried or cremated? Oh, yeah. Oh, come on. I have never seen such clumsy swordplay. I am rubber. You are glue. Oh. Unga, touche. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Really? You win! Give me your treasure, you wax-covered swab. I didn't want it anyway. We're loaded with booty. Okay, because those are the guys that kept beating us the first time around. Alright. Back again. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, and I really am a fearsome pirate. Well, you sure are a fearsome pirate, but think how much more fearsome you could be. Okay, yeah, give me my cabins. Today? today? I'll take the Pain Giver 2000. The Pain Giver 2000 it is. Mom! <laughs> okay. Humiliating for a pirate of my skill and experience. Get back out there then. I believe I lost. Much better. You better leave now if you value your life. You better tell me some bloody insults if you value Iver yours. A mighty pirate. Don't make me laugh. Would you like to be buried or cremated? With you around, I prefer to be fumigated. Thank you. I'll hound you night and day. What this island needs is a good reason. Oh, I'm going to keep there. coming back to you. Heaven preserve me! You look like something that's died! Um, no, I can't I'm not that one yet. Forms are simplified. Give me your treasure! I haven't got any treasure. Why do you think I was attacking you? 
All right, okay, let's go back to the fearsome pirates because they're the ones that are going to give us what we need. Who are you? Who are you? Give me your treasure and I'll let you live. Good luck, boy. Um, so we finally got that one. I have never seen such clumsy swordplay. You would have, but you're always running away. Yay! You're as repulsive as a monkey in a negligee. I look that much like your fiance? Heaven preserve me, you look like something that's died. Oh, yeah? Oh, come on, you use that one yourself. I'll hound you night and day. I am rubber, you are glue. Ugh. You win! Give me your treasure, you reeking, musty, stench-soaked freebooter. Ah, uh, take it. It was cluttering up the hole. We're loaded with boot. Well, you know the drill. Come here, Kenny. Give me guns. What do you have for sale today? Today? The Mr. Massacre. Like the Mr. Massacre brand cannon. One Mr. Massacre coming right up. Mom! Mom! Well, I've got enough bits on them. I should be yep. fighting less fearsome opponents. I know, I didn't want to fight him, but there's no way to run away. Where are they? Hello, pirates! Try again. Ah, oh, there they I'm sure that's the bloody neighbours doing more stuff in their garden. Come on! God 
You've just got to keep trying. Okay, you make it easier. Uh, Haggis? Yes? Could you guys give me a hand with this ship combat stuff? Oh, no, laddie. Wouldn't dream of it. But you wanted to do it on your own. Oh, Haggis. Don't owe Haggis me. We offer our help, and you didn't want it. Don't be that way, Haggis. Help me out just this once, and I'll fix you up with my sister. Not interested. She has a full head of hair. Is it her own hair? Did I mention she's good with children and animals? All right, laddie. I guess we're all in the same boat, and unless we help <gasps> you out, we'll never make it to Blood Island. Easy ship combat it is. Yeah, we did the first bit hard. Oh, let's try again then. Let's face it, we're only here for the insult sword fighting anyway. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, a mighty pirate. Don't make me laugh. Oh, we know that, we know that, we know that. I think we know that, know that. I have never seen such clumsy swordplay. You would have, but you were always Thank running you. away. Killing you would be justifiable homicide. Uh, I sent a letter to the King of Portugal, who never replied. I'll hound you night and day. Well, you would have, but you were always running away. Come on, we haven't had that on. Wow, that was quick. Give me your treasure. Treasure? You wanted treasure? I'm sorry, I'm fresh out. All right, come on, back to him. You best sail away before you get hurt. Your treasure or your life? No, I'll take your booty. Okay. Haven't preserved me. You look like something that's died. The only way you'll be preserved is in formaldehyde. When your father first saw you, he must have been mortified. Well, you would have, but you were all. Yes, but we haven't got that one either. That's a new insult. Thank you very much. You're the ugliest monster ever created. Your odor alone makes me aggravated, agitated, and infuriated. Yeah, I'm gonna lose this one as well. Police has two new insults learned. Give me your treasure. Treasure? You wanted treasure? I'm sorry, I'm fresh out. If you're looking for I mean, you know this is gonna be the same as the first Swordmaster. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, a mighty pirate. Don't make me laugh. When your father first saw you, he must have been mortified. At least mine can be identified. <laughs> Every enemy I've met, I've annihilated. With your breath, I'm sure they all suffocated. Good, this gives us a chance to learn the second one at this one. Did he answer that one? I can't remember. I'll hound you night and day. Oh, yeah? Oh, come on. Hunger, touche. Oh, that is so cliche. Thank you. Wait, did you not say that earlier? You can't match my witty repartee. Um. The Hawk and oh, the Eagle. Guess I don't know that one either. That was a good one, we learned a bit Give there. Me your treasure. If I had treasure, don't you think I'd spend it before oh, grabbing the likes of you? Yeah, it's probably I, just a stream a lot as well. I suppose you would. Never mind then. What be you wanted? Your money I or your life. Plunder your treasure. You won't live to regret this. I'll hound you night and day. Oh, yeah? 
Oh, come on! Killing you would be justifiable homicide. Then killing you must be justifiable Thank you. homicide. I'm pretty sure that's a new one. When your father first saw you, he must have been mortified. Yeah, yeah, we had that one. Mine could be identified. At least mine can be identified. Throughout the Caribbean, my great deeds are celebrated. Too bad they're all fabricated. Yes. You're the ugliest monster ever created. I was thrown off a subway because I had expectorated. Yeah, we haven't got that one. We need to learn that one. We got. I got treasure. a few more. That's treasure? all. You wanted treasure? I'm sorry. How dare you attack my ship? So you're getting most from this guy, so. I'm Cyber Streetwood, a mighty pirate. Don't make me laugh. All right. Oh, suffocated, fiance. Fungicides. You're the ugliest monster ever created. If you don't count all the ones you've dated. <gasps> Ooh, that's a burn. You're as repulsive as a monkey in a negligee. I look that much like your fiance? Oh yes, here we go. We're getting there now. Um Still need this I'll one. I'll hound you night and day. That'd be a good job. Yes! <laughs> Stay! Every enemy I've met, I've annihilated. With your breath, I'm sure they all suffocated. You can't match my witty repartee. I could if you would use some breath spray. <laughs> Give me your treasure. I haven't got any treasure. Why do you okay. think I'm attacking you? I think that's almost it. What be you wanted? I'm Guybrush Threepwood, a mighty pirate. Don't make me so, laugh. Um. Killing you would be justifiable homicide. Then killing you must be justifiable fungicide. Yep. On guard, touche. Oh, that is so. Oh, that is so cliche. All right, come on. Would you like to be buried or cremated? I am rubber, you are glue. Oh, really? Right. I'm pretty sure. When your father first saw you, he must have been mortified. Go on, everything. Oh, yeah. yeah. You win! Give me your treasure. Yeah, grubby bilge swigger. We're loaded with booty. Yep, so. Come on, Kenny. Give me the big guns. Back again, mister. What do you have for sale today? Today, customer name here. I'll take the Destructomatic T47. Whoa, mister. You've entered a select group of pirates. You've just ordered the Destructomatic T-47 armor piercing yes, I know. system with auto-loading and fax motor. Yeah, get what on with it. fine piece of hardware if I do say so myself. Mom! Whoa. Okay, yeah. Let's go for Rottingham. Come on in, mate. Where are you? Well, easy well, mode is well, easy. Well. Look who has washed up on my deck. Hand over that map or taste my sword. I've nothing to fear from you, urchin. Nothing on this earth can save your sorry hide. Hmm, hide, 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 hide. At least mine can be identified. Oh, I don't know. Did that work? You or have not? the sex appeal of a sharpie. 
I look that much like your fiance? <laughs> yes, that's definitely good. Your looks would make pigs nauseated. Nauseated, nauseated. If you don't count all the ones you've dated. Yes, that's another good one. My attacks have left entire islands depopulated. With your breath, I'm sure they all suffocated. Oh yeah, yeah, that's it. Come on. I give you a choice. You can be gutted or decapitated. With you around, I'd prefer to be fumigated. Yes, and another one. When I'm done, your body will be rotted and putrefied. Hmm. The only way you'll be preserved is in formaldehyde. No, I don't think that'll be right. You're a disgrace to your species. You're so undignified. Oh, yeah, 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 that's gotta be. At least mine can be identified. Yes! There we go! We got Sorry, it. Blue. I cannot believe it! I have been defeated in battle! So give me that map, take your ship and skedaddle. You win, you win, you'll get your map back! You were doomed from the start, you kleptomaniac. All right, all right, I give up already. It's no wonder you lost with a sword so unsteady. Merci, I beg you, no more insults, please. Your smell and face remind me of moldy old cheese. Ah! We got the map back. Now we can sail to Blood Island. Okay, when this clip's over, we're going to call it a day for part three. And I'll see you again next week for part four. Enjoy the video. Enjoy what looks like a coming storm. Don't forget, if you've enjoyed what you've been watching, uh, hit the like button and subscribe for more content. And uh, don't forget to leave a comment down below. Nice We've got to today. keep her on course for Blood Island. Helgen? I'm doing all I can here! Argus! Lend a hand! I'm barely holding on myself, mate! Oh, my God, this wind! She's the devil's own! I guess I blacked out for a second. Where's Elaine? She flew a wee bit into the woods when we crashed. Then let's get going. We'll find her, then scour the island for the uncursed diamond ring that'll transform her back to normal. I don't be thinking we will, lad. What do you mean? I, I, I mean, what do you mean, Haggis? This be a mutiny, Captain. We're leaving you. Did I mention that I'm offering my crew a very attractive pension plan? Ah, uh, you did. And the stock options. But we're still leaving. But why, Haggis? Why? Well... I admit being your pirate crew's been a real pleasure. A real pleasure. But we've grown restless. We can hear the voice of the siren calling to us, and she says she'd be wanting us to do her hair. You're going back to being barbers? Aye. We'll be sailing back to Plunder Island just as soon as we can fix the ship. Good luck, Captain Driftwood. It were a pleasure to be looting with you. I guess I'm on my own again.